This is what you call a spontaneous video. At the time of recording this video, around about an hour ago, Joe Hawley has potentially released a new song. And I'm saying potentially not because the song has potentially been released. The song has been released, but it might not be Joe Hawley. I mean, I think it probably is, but I want to start this video by saying that just in case. The reason that it might not be is because it wasn't actually released by the Joe Hawley YouTube channel, but instead under the Joe Hawley topic of YouTube. And it says it was provided by DistroKid, as do all of the other songs as far as I'm aware. But we don't know who DistroKid is, we don't know what kind of power he has, and we don't know the moderations that are in place. Also, the song title, the song contents, and even like the song cover could just all be a mockery. If you want to know what I'm talking about, I recommend you go listen to it. But with that preface in order, I want to talk about what I think could have led to this song on the chance that it was released by Joe Hawley. And if it wasn't released by Joe Hawley and we find that out later on, then I'll just take this video down. I also want to say don't try and contact Joe Hawley for the love of God, please. Honestly, as I'm filming this video, I'm questioning if I'm even going to upload it because I don't want to draw attention to Joe Hawley. Because honestly, I I think that the things that have happened recently, especially with the amount of harassment that he's obviously been getting, might have led to what's released this song. But then again, Joe Hawley's account is currently deactivated on Twitter, so there won't be any way to contact him anyways. I'm kind of on the fence about this. I don't even know why I'm talking, because if you're seeing it, then I've, I've decided. God, I'm a professional YouTuber, if you, if you couldn't tell. Okay, but the song title, if you haven't checked it out yet, is called I Am Confessing with a full stop or a period. And the song cover looks like a Joe Hawley cover, kind of. It's got the same mirroring effect as Weird Banano Yes Please, if you didn't notice. But it looks like it's just been scribbled in MS Paint in like 10 seconds. And to be honest, the song kind of sounds like that too. Now, as far as I'm aware, the song is an original, not a cover, because I don't know what he would have covered. And I'm mainly mentioning that because his cover of Everything Means Nothing to Me is more similar in style than his other stuff, mainly because it's all just computer generated. Now, it makes sense that a lot of people think that this is just a joke. I'm currently on the Hits Discord server, and people are just saying to take it with a grain of salt because it wasn't released by Joe Hawley. But at the same time, if he has released this song, I don't think he's released it as a song, but more so as a statement. Since the document's been released, Joe Hawley has just been denying, denying, denying everything. In ways that have been kind of strange, he hasn't really responded. He's just said that it's not true, or at least heavily implied that it's not true. It's been a really weird situation. But I think that there is a chance that this video is a response to what's happened. And at the very best, it's an acceptance of the fact that he's done bad things, and he knows that now. And at the very worst, it was released by DistroKid, who has an agenda to put words in Joe Hawley's mouth. But no matter what the case, this song doesn't seem like it's come from a place of artistic passion. And if you listen to the song, then you know what I mean. It's not that kind of song. Very similar to the Joe Hawley accusations video, I don't have much raw information to give. I'm just trying to spread the knowledge. And also kind of ask you guys if you know anything or what your thoughts are. And if nothing comes of this, if it's just some random release, or if it wasn't Joe Hawley or something, then like I said, I will just take this video down. I do not want to bring any more eyes on Joe Hawley because he does not need the attention right now. Please don't try and contact him, even though his Twitter is down right now. Don't try. I guess I just hope that Joe Hawley's alright, because this song is pretty disturbing. And even even though I do not condone in any sense the things that he's done or said, I don't wish any more harm on anyone. Also, probably in the pinned comment and in a community post, I will make updates if I know anything new. And if loads of new stuff comes out, which won't happen, then I'll make a video on it and I'll take this one down to update everyone. But yeah, I've got nothing else to add, so have a good day and goodbye.